The police have now told us the man, the name of the man shot and killed by Oklahoma City Police. Officers say Sergio Groover waved a knife at them and refused commands. That's when they opened fire on the stabbing suspect Sunday night. KOCO's Megan Mosley was at the scene today near Northwest 25th and spoke with neighbors Southwest 25th there, talking with neighbors in the area. Yeah, that incident unfolding over the weekend, just feet away from this nearby business. Workers tell me this is typically a quiet neighborhood. It's pretty quiet. You don't, you don't see anything happening around here. What he calls a quiet neighborhood became the scene of a disturbance call to police after 21 year old Sergio Groover allegedly waved a knife at his family members Sunday evening and stabbing someone nearby. They gave him several commands uh, to drop the knife, that man refused those commands. Oklahoma City Police tell us the entire scene ended within seconds and they were unable to get their mental health unit on scene. They say they tried tasing Groover twice. He then became aggressive at an officer with his knife before two other officers shot him. One officer did deploy his taser twice, which was ineffective. Officers tell me there are several reasons a taser could be ineffective and they aren't ready to discuss the why in this case. It's crazy just to think that something like that would would happen so close to somewhere you work at, you know. Groover was taken to the hospital where he later died, and police say the person he stabbed was treated at the hospital and later released. And those officers have been placed on administrative leave as this investigation continues. In Southwest Oklahoma City, Megan Mosley, KOCO 5 News.